you know. The last time my mama worked was almost six months ago. <laughs> Right, that's my mother had to go to go to uh clock in and thing like that was six months ago. You know what I'm saying? So it just felt good, you know what I mean, be able to take care of my mom and shit. That the hell that good, that I enjoy her the rest of her rest of her years, you know what I'm saying? Cause feel me, she worked hard for that shit, man. She raised she raised a lot of badass kids, bro. You feel me? Real talk. I'm gonna raise a lot of badass kids, but especially me. I was a bad motherfucking kid, man. So, you know what I'm saying? When, when you know your mom work hard every day, wake up early every morning, get the kids ready to go to school, and still got to make the work, then after she get off work, come home, cook for us, clean for us, wash the clothes, and all that shit, man. You know what I'm saying? Feel good to, to let your mama, you know what I'm saying? Let your mama live a life that a lot of people don't get the experience, you feel me? So, like, now nah, my mother don't gotta do none of that shit. I told her she won't wash clothes, how somebody do that shit? You feel me? Get bougie on. I told my mama get bougie on the ass to fuck, the, fuck all the bullshit, to eat that up. Hmm. Yeah. You know me that? Yeah, told her get bougie on her, to turn up on the ass, mom. Fuck talking about. You wanna wear a little time every day, you wear a little time every day. You wanna go shopping every day, you go shopping every day. Mama get what mama want for the time I took. So, you know. Make sure my mother. Make sure my mama you know what I'm saying? She gotta stay straight. Feel me? I don't want my mother out here stressing and shit. Oh, some fuckboy trying to turn up tea up on me, nigga. Like, I ain't never gonna put me, you know what I'm saying? Like, this shit real. This zoo shit real. My own mama knows something. The king of the zoo for real, man. You feel me? So. But I just learned how to manage myself, how to how to keep myself from around the dumb shit. You know, I got too much money to be around, around dumb shit. Yeah. You know? Fuck, I don't know why I gotta separate myself, man. I don't, I don't fuck with niggas if they ain't on my level, bro. You feel me? And I don't even mean on my level money wise. I'm talking about on my level mentally. That's what's wrong with you niggas. Y'all niggas try to pocket niggas. Y'all try to y'all try to chill with niggas that got y'all pockets. That that shit don't mean nothing. Just cause a nigga got money don't mean he's smart nigga. He just a dumb nigga with money. You know what I'm saying? You got dumb niggas with money. You got dumb niggas without money. You got smart niggas with money. You got smart niggas without money. It is what you gonna be, man. Hmm? All I know is I was one of the smart niggas. You hear me? Cause two. Been on their run for a little while now, and how many times they told me I was supposed to be done with this shit, or how many times they told me my shit wasn't gonna go nowhere to eat that shit up, bro. Hmm. Am I rookie? I'm still a rookie, right? And I'm still, yeah, technically I'm still a rookie in this shit, man. Uh, I'm, st I'm a fucking rookie in this shit, still, nigga. I'm a rookie with the music shit, man. Uh, I'm a rookie in the music shit. <laughs> <laughs> this is sound funny. <laughs> I am. I really am though. This is real shit though. How many niggas gonna admit that shit? Only fake niggas won't say that shit. Just cause I got four singers, that don't mean I'm no fucking vet, nigga. I ain't no motherfucking vet. I'm a fucking rookie, man. I just started doing this shit. But I get paid like a vet, motherfucker. <laughs> what you talking about too? <laughs> now eat that shit up. <laughs> I don't worry about the shit, man. Where Reek at? Reek, I think Reek would say. Yeah, I think Reek, I think Reek would say.